In the darkest days of World War II, a revolutionary aircraft soared above the skies of Britain, becoming both shield and sword against Nazi Germany's onslaught. The Supermarine Spitfire, with its distinctive elliptical wings, wasn't just a machine. It was the culmination of one man's engineering brilliance. Reginald Mitchell, a locomotive engineer's apprentice from Staffordshire, designed this masterpiece despite knowing he wouldn't live to see its finest hour. Diagnosed with cancer in 1933, Mitchell worked feverishly until his death in 1937, driven by reports from Germany that war was inevitable. His genius lay in the Spitfire's perfect balance, a thin elliptical wing providing both agility and space for eight machine guns. When Luftwaffe bombers darkened British skies in 1940, Mitchell's creation proved its worth, becoming the only Allied fighter in continuous development throughout the entire war. Though the hurricane claimed more victories during the Battle of Britain, the Spitfire captured Britain's imagination and became the symbol of defiance that helped save a nation on the brink of defeat.